Can someone remind me why I tried to do this again? Well, we do this for the love of it. It's right here on our hearts. We do it for the love of it, man. That's all there is. We do it for the love. Peace. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So today you've seen the title. I'm going to be trying to ride Goofy, but I'm a regular rider so it's pretty much like riding with your left hand or something. It's just going to be really weird. Uh, I'm going to go to the skate park in a bit and try that out, but first I want to start by doing some Goofy tricks on the trampoline just to kind of get a feel for what is possible and like how stuff is but anyway let's get on the tramp scoot and try some goofy tricks all right so the first main thing obviously is tail whips and heel whips are switched so if i do a tail whip and goofy it's like i'm doing a heel whip but it's not my arms are gonna feel like it's doing a heel whip it's really weird and then a heel whip is obviously gonna be my regular thing so like if i tried to do a kickless or something i would do a oppo goofy kickless but it's gonna be really hard for me to Remember to land Goofy. I think that's going to be a problem. So let's just do a tail whip to start. Okay. Oh. Okay, a tail whip is pretty easy. Um, and now let's try a heel whip. So this is actually like a tail whip. But it's a heel whip. Which makes no sense. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm almost like wanting to land cross foot. Because what would be my back foot is in the front. But I want to turn my feet, so I'm almost just landing cross foot, but I'll have to figure out how to not do that. Let's land this heel whip. Oh, I got it. <laughs> I bet it looks really weird when I do stuff, but, you know, whatever. That's kind of the point of this challenge. Okay, bar spin should be the same. It just, my feet feel a little weird. I guess let's do oppo bar spin. <laughs> because everything else is awful today. Okay, let's try like a double tail whip. Oh, I got it first try. Now, even harder, double heel whip. Oh, I got it. Okay, so I'm kind of figuring out how to do it. Got double whip, double heel. What should we try next? I feel like like a tail whip rewind. Maybe I'll try a kickless, but I'll do a goofy whip kickless because or oppo kickless goofy because that feels like a normal one to me. Okay, I figured out the secret to not landing crossfoot. I really have to like, right before I land, I really have to like turn to make sure I don't put my feet the wrong way. Oh, I got it. Oh, <laughs> I didn't really land with my front foot on, but I still count it. Okay, don't expect me to land this at the skate park. <laughs> But I'm gonna try a bry flip. Oh god. How does that even. How do those even work? Okay, I wonder if I can do like a whip bar. <laughs> oh, late whips are weird. Oh. Got it, barely. All right, I think we're gonna head down to the skate park now. So it's actually like 5 p.m. and I hope that that'll mean there'll be a bit less people there and we'll still have a good amount of daylight to ride. We'll have like three hours. So I'm probably gonna be doing some regular tricks too because I feel like watching me do all goofy tricks will be boring because I can probably only do like tail whips and maybe some combos. So I'll probably do some regular tricks as well, try to learn a couple new things, but we're just gonna head down there and see what happens. I'm starting out with some basic tricks right on this bank. I'm just trying to do a tail whip right now, but it's really awkward and hard, and I look like i am never scooted before, so we're just gonna try this. We're try gonna try to land some basic tricks out of this bank right here. Nope. Yeah. Guys, I did a tail whip. It's a big moment. All right, it's time to do a heel whip, which was a lot harder on the tramp scoot. So I feel like it might be extremely hard on an actual scooter. Oh. I actually got a first try, but it felt really weird. Oh, double whip is gonna be so hard. I also might try to do air tricks later, which is gonna be really scary. I'll probably do them on the two though, because I'm a wimp. Oh. It's like a double heel, but then just with a stupid landing. 
Oh, that was so awkward. Got it. And I'm leaving the park. Let's see if I can tell what flat. Here we go. Yes. All right, I'm gonna try double heel, which I don't know if this will be easier or harder than the double tail whip because it's actually like a tail whip with my hands, but it's a weird landing. Let's just see. Yeah. I think I'm gonna move over to the two foot and try to do some air tricks and maybe some stalls. Okay, time to try a tail whip air. I'm gonna do it really low, because I'm scared. Oh God. Oh God, going fast. Oh! I made it. Okay, screw that. I'm gonna try a heel whip air. I think this is actually gonna be really hard even though it's more like a tail whip. Oh! Okay, I did it. It was a little bit of toe drag, but I don't care. Oh! I'm gonna try a bri, but I can almost guarantee this is not gonna work. Not even close. Yeah! Yeah! Now we're just gonna go back to regular riding and we're gonna ride this hump right here. We're taking a quick intermission actually, because I wanna see if I can jump over that trash can out of the six. Uh. Oh! Yeah. Sketch! I got it though. Okay, time for some high quality lumpage. That was really sketchy. Okay, I'm just gonna do some chill stuff on the half pipe. I actually have a cool idea. I wanna do a line where I do umbrella, then a whip umbrella, then a buttercup. So it's like progression, adding a whip every time and I think it'll be a little bit difficult. So there might be some funny fails in there, but I kind of am doing a new style of filming where I have the GoPro going and the big camera at the same time. So. It takes a tiny bit more effort when I'm editing, but tell me if you guys like it because I think it's cool to have both angles. So anyway, I'm gonna start trying to do this line. Nope. Ah. Okay. So this is how it's gonna be. See, the problem is all these tricks are hard to maintain speed with. So I'm like, I have to really struggle to keep my speed. Oh, sketchy again. I don't care. Ah! No. See, that's the hard part, because it's like there's a slight difference in the flick between all these tricks, and it's so hard to go between them. Ah. Dang it. This sucks. Oh. 
someone remind me why I tried to do this again? Well, we do this for the love of it. It's right here on our hearts. We do it for the love of it, man. That's all there is. You know? No sponsors, no just cash, man. We do it for the love. Peace. Ah, uh, I get so freaking tired that I can never get the buttercup around. What? Yes! Okay, I'm gonna do some downside air tricks because I don't think I've ever shown it when it's not on the GoPro and I think it might look kind of cool or it might look dumb. Either way, I want to show it. No one's ready for my drop-in tactic. You all right? My bars are bent. Hey guys, I know that my bars are bent, so stop saying that. I, they don't really affect my ride, so I don't care that they're bent. Someone told me to do a downside triple whip, so I'm gonna try that. Alright, now I'm going to try for a trick that someone suggested a long time ago, but I wasn't able to do it. And it's a downside finger whip, but now that I'm getting better at downside stuff, I think I should be able to do it. That was freaking stupid. Yeah! Yeah! Uh, I did it. I know it was a long time ago that someone suggested that, but I just figured out how to do it. So if you remember commenting that, thank you. It was a good trick. All right, guys. So good session today. Riding Goofy was really weird, but it was a pretty fun challenge. And I recommend you guys try it if you want to know like how it feels instead of just listening to my stupid descriptions of it. Anyway, one quick announcement before I end off this video. If any of you guys remember, uh, about a year ago, exactly, almost exactly a year ago, we went on a trip to a place called Ajamawi, and I'll play a clip of that right now if you don't remember. <laughs> you big <dumb. laughs> I can't oh, swim. Owen. Oh, and... <laughs> Anders doesn't know how to swim. No. <laughs> Yeah, that was interesting. But anyway, we're gonna be going back there this coming weekend, which is a four-day weekend, so I get two days off school, and we're gonna go back down there. It's gonna be an awesome time. I'm probably gonna film like a cinematic thing like I did for Utah, so that's gonna be awesome. Get hyped for that. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to smash the like button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.